Um, and uh, thanks, Heron, for talking about that app. We have uh, Alyssa Bauman joining us now. What do you think about apps like that, just out of curiosity? I, th I think they're fantastic. Anything that can get you sort of eating Any healthier? And anything that can get you he eating healthier, exercising more, motivated, absolutely. Okay. Well, you're here to talk to us about getting back to healthy eating. A lot of people have New Year's resolutions mm -hmm. and, you know, whether it's, you know, a new year or not, eating healthy is always a good thing. So let's talk about how do you start? Because um, I always hear, oh, the breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Is it really the most important meal breakfast of the day? Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. And just to let you know that coffee and a muffin is not breakfast. That was me this morning. Okay, that's a caffeine <laughs> jolt and a sugar rush. Okay. Which probably left you feeling very hungry around 11 o'clock, yes. maybe a little bit rattled. That's me normally, though. Okay. <laughs> so what would be an ideal breakfast, then? Um, over here, I have two, three, three items here, ideal breakfast. These are quick, easy, on the go, as most of us are. Mm -hmm. um, avocado and whole grain toast. You can play around with your toast. You can play around with um, sprouted toast, rye toast, all sorts of different toasts. Um, spread it with avocado. This is the fat that our body needs. This is good the, fat. This is the good fat. And avocado is loaded with folate, antioxidants. It's it's one of those superfoods. It sure is. Okay, now let's talk about what else you have here. This, this is oatmeal? This is an easy instant package oatmeal. I would definitely go for the sugar-free one. Oh, yes. Yeah, because the, sugar, the ones that have the sugar in it have the fillers, and they're loaded with sugars, which makes our palate even more adjusted to the sweetness. We don't need all the sweetness. Now, uh, you also have yogurt with berries that you recommend just to sweeten it up a little bit. Yes, and if those who can't, a lot of people can't do dairy, um, coconut milk has a great yogurt out there that you can take, and it has just amazing carbohydrates for you and all the essential needs that we have for breakfast. Okay, so um, as far as setting yourself up for success, it means having a lot of veggies and grains ready to go. Ready to go. Do that? Very easy. Go to the market, the grocery store, wherever it may be that you're shopping at. Come home, take the time, 40 minutes maximum, wash, dry, and chop everything and put it in glass containers so you have it and you can see it. See you, can, it. you build your salads, grab and go snacks, you can base your meals around it. It doesn't get any easier than this. And you can do the same thing with the steel cut oats and the quinoa. Um, I have this in my refrigerator all week long and I build it again. I base my meals off of it. How do you make this, by the way? So easy. Um, it's like rice. It's exactly like rice. It takes much, it takes uh, about five minutes less time and it's not as filling as a brown rice. Okay, let's talk about some of the veg that you brought in for us. Whoops. Uh, you have kale, which I love. Kale is an absolute superfood. Mm -hmm. um, uh, most greens are, actually. They're loaded with vitamins, A, C, E, and K, K, folate, fiber, and protein, which a lot of people don't know. But the one thing I really love about greens, and you can't get enough of them, because they actually reduce sugar cravings. Oh, okay. And who doesn't need that? No, we don't need they that. They strengthen the immune system. Um, I have kale chips here, which are super easy to make. Just bake them with a little olive oil and sea salt. Mmm, sounds delicious. This is a green juice. It doesn't look very good, but I guarantee if you taste it, you will like it. <laughs> okay. It's kale, cucumber celery, lemon, and ginger, and it has a nice zing, and you feel the energy move in your body. Did you just make this this morning? I just made it this morning. Can I morning. have a sip? Absolutely. Okay, I'm going to do it. And tell us about some of these healthy snacks these that you brought some, in. Uh, healthier snacks, so healthier alternatives. We have almond butter, butter and, and some apples. We have a couple different flavors of hummus here. This is edamame hummus. They also have spinach hummus. I also have here some nuts, some uh, Brazilian nuts, cranberries, pumpkin seeds, loaded with zinc loaded with the good fat. So a handful of this is perfect, which is why I also mixed it with some dried fruit to get that sweetness. And this is a local company, the Brio Bar, which I really mm. like. Um, they're tasty, they're delicious, and there's only about five ingredients in there. So eating healthy is quite simple if you just sort of give yourself a little time to prep for it. Exactly. All right, well thanks so much, Alyssa, for Thank coming in. So and by much. the way, this is really quite tasty. Okay, you Better can than it, it looks indeed. Okay, good. <laughs>